Hi everyone, Lucia back with another uh, jewelry bag an opening. Today I have two bags. I am showing you one. This is one. This is number one. And I have another one here. I got these two uh, from a uh, from a lady. I do go and volunteer um, once in a while and I donate some of the, uh, the jewelry to a uh, nursing home it's more like an assisted community so there was a lady over there and we talked a little bit and she said uh, I have a big collection of 50 years of collecting jewelry and she she said if you're interested and I was like oh yes for sure so she made me two bags and she said go go and open them and if you're happy uh, then we can talk uh, so yeah that's what I'm doing today so this came from a 70-year-old uh, lovely lady and she made this for me uh, from her collection so that's what I'm what I'm doing today oh I'm so excited you guys uh, <laughs> I'm gonna open this one and then next one for 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 another video if I can hold a week if I can last for a week but yeah let's see let's go to her collection and see what we have this is a ooh la la it is a big bag. Oh my. Oh my, my. Uh, let's take a peek first. Please. <laughs> please, please. See micro mosaic. I see. Oh my. This is a. I, I don't think she ever wore this, or maybe. I don't know why is this. The thread is over there. This is a Kenneth J. Lane, I, I think. It looks like a let me check wow i'm i'm so excited you guys what is the marking on this one i saw the kjl yes okay it's a lion head enamel gorgeous an excellent shape okay cool and i saw these should i move them some of you guys like to see the the whole thing um some get distracted so I think I'm just gonna move it like that I said am I okay let me check do I need to go higher a little bit maybe like this yeah okay next I'm so excited you guys a lovely bracelet gold tone these are glass like bluish not sure how do you call this um, there is a name for this glass yeah sure and of course my brain is it's out but that's that's fine that's fine we're enjoying the jewelry here okay right and this one are these ones clip-ons earring uh, earrings Judy Lee of course I'm already in wow 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 clip-ons and I have one brooch one is silver tone one is gold one. This one is with tiger's eye, and this one is with the um, agate. Look at this. It looks like a landscape. I love this type of bracelets. Uh, <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. Uh, the agate. Whatever. You know what I'm saying, guys. It's been a while since I opened up. <laughs> okay. Uh, shoot. <laughs> shoot, shoot. No, I'm just excited. Because every time you get something, you know, it's. Uh, coming from a collection then it's much more exciting than opening a jar then we have a necklace oh Lucia a, these are very lightweight looks antique to me They're like a Victorian style these are some sort of a plastic but they're very light lightweight light light very light Ooh la la, and I see. Oh, I'm missing a stone on this one. Maybe it's in here. Okay, I have another brooch, a lovely one. Nothing is missing on this one. Right, stunning. Just have to clean them. And this one looks like a Sorelli. It is a sor no, it's a sweet romance. This one, and I'm missing one rhinestone, a red one. Maybe it's in here. 
sweet aroma and so on, of course. So. And I believe these are, what are these? Desert Heart. The necklace. They kind of look like the Miriam Haskell, the, the pearls, and also the design, the setting. I'm so sorry about the noise. Okay. Then I have a pretty chunky bracelet, bangle here. I do have something over there engraved or marked. Okay. I don't know. Over here, there is something. Okay, let's check. I think it's 9 to 5 Mexico or something. Looks like a Mexican silver. I need to clean this one and polish. It's pretty tarnished. This is a nice one. Not too heavy though. And of course we have a fish here and a teddy bear. Oh, this is really cute. I don't see anything on this one. It's tarnished too. It might be silver. Not sure. So the fish and a teddy bear. Teddy, teddy. This one, oh my, another bracelet here. So, yeah, I need to clean them though. Uh, she told me that they need cleaning. Okay, she said that they were sitting in her uh, in the boxes uh, for years. She's not wearing them anymore except her rings. And she said that uh, she's gonna show me her ring collection soon. So, yeah. This is a very interesting kind of a modernist bracelet. This is also Mark 9 to 5. Right, oh, what's going on up there? I'm so sorry. I should pause for a second and wait for the noise. Away. Then we have this thermal set, almost like a gold stone. Stones here. This is uh, tangled over here. I'm afraid to put it on over place, but I will off camera because I need to put my my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing. But this is beautiful. It's the necklace and the bracelet. Okay, and I see some brooches here. Okay, okay. let's take the brooches out. Okay, this one has a cartouche. K A T E Kathy with an E and then this one. Lovely both of them. Okay, and then I have oh this is so pretty too. This one. It's a bird, right? I think it's missing. I think nothing. And these are some really nice vintage hoops here. Probably Mexican silver. Okay. Do I have the other one with this thing? Okay, I don't see the other one. Am I losing it or what is going on? Okay, I'll set this one aside. Oh, it's here. Yeah. Okay. I need to clean this one too, yeah, because they are tarnished. But these are uh, screw back earrings. Beautiful. Right, right, right. And we have another brooch. This one is also Kenneth J. Lane. Yes. So I have this and this. These are both Kenneth J. Lane. Cool. Cool, cool. Now this is engraved FMA. I think this is gold filled. Right? The bangle. And 
find something inside as it's I cannot tell I cannot read that whatever it what is it over there but it's it's beautiful okay then we have a pearl a freshwater pearls and probably this is silver I love this one let me put it on why not yeah how pretty it is right a necklace with a watch pendant here 10 karat gold field s and w somebody made the necklace and they added the watch these are lapis this one looks like an alpaca i believe lovely blue colors and this one to hold. This is a Maltese cross brooch and a pendant. Wow. I love that it's a pendant and a brooch. I love the size. It's big. Big, big. Okay, cool. Right. Then we have. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's a mushroom and a ladybug. Wow how lovely this is on a silver tone very shiny chain an excellent shape this one and I'm trying to read here I don't have my glasses though oh shoot I cannot read you guys I was so excited to show you to open the, the bag that oh uh, I forgot about everything, but that is fine. And this is a gold tone, a coral. The bracelet is coral. I'm not sure if the pendant is uh, from the bracelet. They don't look the same. Okay. Yeah, but that's another I need to clean them because I can. They were a bit dirty. And these are glass pearl bead okay and this is I don't know what I think it's silver but I have three I, I have no idea what are these then maybe you put them on a necklace or what is this supposed to be a pendant it looks like a napkin ring to me. Anyway, oh, I see a mini mosaic. This one is a Monet, a clamper. I love the texture. And this gold tone bracelet. Alrighty. 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 Oh, this is another set I have. The necklace okay go a little bit further so, yeah gold tone uh, this kind of looks like a monet it is not it is it is it is three zero zero three whatever that means I have no idea yeah over there the necklace and the bracelet cleaning pile I'll be busy cleaning them it's another vintage and I have a fish tail here blue with a hidden clasp necklace is that lucite beads This is a fish, but uh, no drills, so it's just a fish. Okay, cool. 
I believe is also sterling on a leather cord pendant flower and I want to see this one I saw this one I want to check this one I need to untangle them first okay this is like a sweater clip or what I think so some sort of a clip tangled here no worries is it yeah Am I missing something here? Because they are not identical. Right? This one has a dangle. And this one does not. I'm not sure. Oh, I think it was supposed to be like that. Right, it's very pretty. A clip. And I have a snake. Okay, then we have a one of those Italian stretch bracelets the ones that I cannot wear yeah they pull your hair out oh this is so pretty a very beautiful etched bracelet bangle and there is some marking over there let me see if I can show you okay testing a cross I think this is also sterling double-sided one side and then the other one testing that one and we have a dried flower uh, crescent moon here pendant I love this one one two good One at a time, let's see. Oh. Check these ones out. Also, clip ons. It looks like a dragon's breath. Nothing in inside or on the back. But these ones, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I think this is dragon's breath. Right? So. Okay, this is another pin uh, with a frog on. <laughs> this is so cute, and you can remove the frog. Cool. Now I wanted to look at this one. It's very like a piece of tapestry or something on this pendant. But look at the. There is a marking in the back. I don't know what it means, but I love the work on the pendant. I'll show you close. And also the chain looks like it's sterling silver, this one too. I think so. Yes, it's marked on the clasp. Okay. I have a lovely heart here a glass one and it's engraved or marked I love it I love this one a lot too alrighty these are costume earrings uh, rings oh one then I have a butterfly here and then also this one And this one, I think this is quartz. It's a uh, wire wrapped ring. Somebody made this. Okay, I like it. I'll put it on this hand, on this finger. I mean, yeah, it's it's nice. Okay, let's see what else. These are. Amber earrings, handmade, okay, and amethyst. Okay, come on. This should look like that. Right, and then I have another ring, another butterfly. Okay. Cool. 
and this is I have another mini mosaic Bro brooch I had another one right where is the other one shoo, 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 shoo. okay I don't see it but that's fine and oh some hair also Rustin's Craft or something. Not sure. This looks old. I don't know what kind of a material that is. It's lightweight. They kind of look like flowers. Right? And I'll show you in the packet. Okay. This is another set. I love the pearls on this one. And the tubes, gold tone. Okay, so we have the necklace and the bracelet here. Okay, both of them. Lovely, these ones. Look at the pearls. How pretty they are. Okay. And I have two more of the pearl. This one is Monet. And this one is Mark G. Silver. They definitely need a bit of cleaning and another beautiful cross. Wow. I think this one is gold filled, maybe. I don't see anything or any markings. Let me double check with my loop. I think it's gold filled, but it's beautiful. These are marked OT Sterling, Native American inlay here. Not sure if I'm missing something, like some dangles, I'm not sure. They don't have dangles, but they do have the holes, okay? Lovely colors on those ones. Lovely, lovely. Is this one with the... No, it's different. And it looks like Miriam Haskell. And these two earrings. These. Okay, come on. These. And. No, this is not an earring. Hold on. No, it's not. Okay. These ones. I need to do some research on. Definitely somebody uh, replaced the, the hooks. They don't match. It's not the same tone, same metal tone. These are tortolani. I believe these are earrings too. A very interesting design on these ones. Right. Okay. Cool, cool. And we have crystals here. I love the sound. Clip-ons. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. And then we have a pin. And a B. I think this is a B. And this one. Oh, there is something on there. I think it's an Avon. Yes, it is an Avon. Of this bracelet, so this one before. So it looks like a Sorelli. An antique gold tone, and then we have the snake earrings. Where is the other one? here. Alrighty. I'll be more prepared next time. I promise you guys. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I got excited and distracted because I wanted to share 
with you guys. It's another beautiful gold tone. Monet. Okay. Then we have this one, a silver tone. I'll we'll definitely need some cleaning. It looks like an art deco. Rhinestones and nothing is missing. So the only thing that is missing is just the one. Just, oh, another one. Hold on. Oh, that's a lot of hair in here. Oh my. Okay. Well, she told me that they need cleaning, so yeah. She's been collecting for 50 years, so. Okay. Another one. Also with rhinestones. Okay. Just a beautiful heart. Um, kind of a Celtic design. Like a Viking design or something. Yeah. I love it. And the chain too. So probably sterling silver. Then we have a heart. A bracelet. I think she added some of the charms, uh, uh, some of the links here. They don't all match. I need to test this one though. I'm not doing any testing today. Today I'm enjoying the bag. And the other one is bigger, you guys. Oh wow. It's bigger and heavier. <laughs> okay, we have a pair of These are Lucite, or I might test them for Bakelite. Earrings, these are screw back. No marking. Okay, and this has pearls and also rose quartz beads. Oh, very delicate. Dainty. Dainty. The pearls and the of rose quartz they are so pretty together alrighty and this one is a long gold tone and also rhinestones necklace so I think you can wear it like this because the hook is attached over there at the end so we can wear it like this and it can be like a Y necklace. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> okay. Right. It's a beautiful mother of pearl curved necklace here. So definitely I'm happy with this bag. I'm, I'm going to call her and tell her that I want to <laughs> get more. I want more. These are, I don't know what kind of a stones on these. Maybe agates or... No, I think it's jasper. And also turquoise. Uh, this one is like a pietrocyte, I think. I need to show you the flash on this one. On the pendant. It's not a tiger eye. Or maybe it's a... Not sure. Dark tighter eye, but this is beautiful. I love it. I love it. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I have. Oh, what is the other one? The mushroom. Here. <laughs> it's cute. Cute, cute. Mushrooms. Okay. <laughs> post earrings. And these are also post cubes. Go tone. And a little. Oh, this is a tiny, tiny spoon pin. I love the mushrooms. <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Right. Oh my. Holy. Okay, let's check these ones. Uh, they are marked sterling. Wow. How pretty they are. You guys need to see these ones. And nothing is missing, right? I don't think so. Stunning. I love them. Okay. Then. Um, wow. Mm, 
these are opal, coral and probably jade earrings. I do have my glasses on. I, I went and I got my glasses, but I can't see anything. Still can't see. I need to change my prescription. It's not quite working for me. And look how pretty these ones are. Also sterling silver. Flowers, look, petals. Which one should I show? My word. We're almost done. These are listener leaves, leaves, a clip ons. This is a locket, breath, and some copper. Really nice size. And I, okay, again. <laughs> I'm so sorry guys I think these are also sterling okay I'm so sorry yeah, I, I do live one minute near a um, fire station so it's okay they are busy and God bless them what, what we're saying now here oh, I think these are sterling silver and a little bit of an inlay, a lapis inlay. They kind of look maybe Asian or something. And this gold tone ones. Okay. Alright, we have a troll bead here, marked 9 to 5. and probably crystals, Swarovski crystals. And I do believe this one is a Miriam Haskell, but boy, look at the knots in over there. Might take me a while. Uh, based on the colors and, uh, you know, the way the pearls are looking, I think this is a Miriam Haskell piece, but I will have to do research. I'm not an expert. Um, I think that's a Miriam Haskell. And another lovely brooch, gold tone, and a heart, two hearts here, a green one, crystals and a uh, crystal, and this one is a porcelain, some sort of ceramic. Okay, and I think that's it. I showed everything. I think so. Yes, I think, I think. Okay, let's see. Man, I had so much fun. So, so much fun. Okay, this this one and the micro mosaic the Native American earrings oh I love this one to the cross this is the one the Kenneth J. Lane both of them absolutely gorgeous everything oh I have these ones these two grace yeah, I don't know if I, oh, I don't know if I can pick a favorite today. Can I? Should I? Could I? Would I? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My mushrooms. The mushroom and the, uh, what is out here? And then here. And oh, this one's and this one. I, I, I can, I cannot pick. No, 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 not today. I just. Uh, <laughs> the highlights here just highlighting oh, no we cannot pick a favorite not today and the teddy bear is cute and this one the sweet romance well, anyway um, I'm sorry guys if I got a bit uh, distracted and I was over excited oh these ones too yeah that's what happened when you buy uh, someone's collection <laughs> you get you get really excited right um, so I have another bag uh, for you guys 
please let me know which one was your favorite I would love to know as always uh, leave a comment and let me know and I will open the other bag probably this week let's 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 see uh, we have a lot of nice stuff in this one oh, more uh, this is micro mosaic just gonna take a sneak peek on this one another micro mosaic garage over there oh I think this is jade yeah and then another jade okay uh, yeah okay. just uh, a little bit I will give it to my son and he will <laughs> hold it for me <laughs> until next week okay and tomorrow no yes tomorrow it's Sunday and I will have a live uh, chat with uh, Dana my guest from uh, right killer queen vintage and antique jewelry so we will have a, a little chat me and her on my channel tomorrow at one o'clock so if you guys want to join um, we will be more than happy to uh, say hello to you and if you have any questions please uh, please join us I'm so excited to finally introduce her on my channel to you guys okay so yeah I'll see you tomorrow at one o'clock ish I'm thinking um, on my channel okay thank you so much guys I hope this was fun I'm planning on uh, calling her and asking for <laughs> for more because this was fun and most almost everything it's um, it's in great shape it's resellable maybe a few pieces I need to figure it out how to clean them but most of them are uh, in great shape so if you guys are interested in any of this uh, email me I will leave my information or you can text me okay I usually don't give you any prices because I do not know I need to test them first and clean them and then I can give you a price I cannot just give you a price as we go okay that's it for oh this one too look how pretty it is okay that's it for today thank you so much guys for watching I will see you in my next one take care bye bye